Let's go back to town. Oh, we get more optional dialogue again. That's cool. I don't know. I don't think they would have rushed us and flanked us. Uh, they were doing pretty well staying on the high ground. Uh, oh, it's one of the immortals. I like the detail that the other people around are actually members of our team. That's a good detail. <laughs> yeah, Camp Dalek, so we get to have sex in the tent. Depends on if the game is developed by Bioware. <laughs> Learning more about the characters. I see someone eavesdropping. How have they not noticed him yet? Yeah, he's standing next to a torch. It's not like he's in the darkness. Uh, the majority are against it. Great. Yeah, why are the majority of the officials against us uh, taking out Alphonse exactly? Uh, hey, Quintus, can you tell us which one of the immortals marked Alphonse and if it was the guy who's clearly a vampire? I'm guessing we're going to get marked. Figured. <laughs> that job sounds boring. Sitting around in a council room all day for like a, for what was it, like hundreds of years they live? You're being a bit of a bitch, Kyrie. 
take the fucking promotion, please. <laughs> You're being promoted to the rank where you might become immortal? I think you should take the promotion. I know desk jobs aren't for everybody, but, you know. Accept the fucking jib. Job. It's the best typo. <laughs> Man, is that easy? Oh, I got an achievement marked for glory. I can see why they'd nominate Alphonse. Alphonse can bring money into the mortals, and the mortals can use money to develop the nation. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know the motivation yet. I figure it's some kind of corruption, though. I would kill my desk for a job. <laughs> I like my desk. My desk helps me with my job. Okay, so we need to visit all four temples and return to the capital. All right, well, in essence, that's what the pilgr pilgrimage entails. Okay, so we understand more of what the pilgrimage is. I mean, that's a good excuse to go to wide and varied lands if every temple's on, like, a different corner of the world. Wow. Alphonse isn't allowed to call foul play when we beat the shit out of him. I mean, he's allowed to fight back. Uh, I'm guessing the marked can fight each other. From what he was saying there, it seems that the, the marked are allowed to pursue each other. And from what we've been told before, marked are often killed by other marked. Are the temples element themed? I would assume because it's a tactics RPG and that's always how it ends up being. What do you mean what ended up happening? You watched her get marked. The magic takes a toll. You know, someone should be tending to that soup. See a jet stream. Became a Marth. This grants her access to a special class with many powerful abilities. Give her a new class uh, a look in the troops menu. Sure. Uh, see, he's on his knees there because it's to signify he's injured. He has one injury, so his stats are 10% lower. And if you keep using him and he keeps dying, the injuries are going to stack. You could become immortal, which means you're gonna die. <laughs> Alright, so what's this class then? Because maybe I'll make, uh... What's her face? I always forget her name. Anodyne. Maybe I'll make Anodyne the crazy good tank. If we have a special class here. So, marked. Level 1 of 12. Maul, sword, spear, rod, robe, light armor, heavy armor, and shield. Okay, so she has a pretty wide variety of equipment she could use. Her stat growth, which is blocked by my webcam, sorry, uh, is a lot of health, a good amount of MP, attack, defense, mind, resistance, speed, okay. It's pretty strong stat growth overall. Her master thing you can see there next to that gold star, when she masters this, 10 health, 10 attack, 10 mind, and what looks to be, I think, some resistance to holy and dark, I would assume that is. Um, this seems like a really powerful class, which I guess makes sense, because main character. The power is increased as they draw energy from each relic in the land, so I'm guessing the class gets stronger as we go to different areas. So what do we know with this class? Okay, so by default, Dark Bolt. Single target, ranged attack, deal attack plus mind dark damage from a distance. 
1 to 3 range. Vertical of 13, so you can fire it uphill pretty easily. And it's versus defense, not resistance. Okay. That's a really strange spell. It's attack and mind, and it doesn't attack resistance, which magic usually does, attacks defense. So that's... That spell would probably be really good at attacking wizards and, like, other spellcasters. Hmm. Alphonse didn't try to kill us outright. Uh, why? He tried to run, because I think he was just going for the temple. Because if we're invoking our right to self-defense, we probably could have just killed him there. Because they didn't- the council didn't come in and veto the law that we passed yet. So, if we had killed him before the council arrived, nothing they can do about it. Maybe we'd get arrested, but Alphonse would be dead. Wrathful Blow? Wow, these are like, a lot of dark spells. A little bit of holy, you get holy bolt eventually. A lot of these moves seem kind of evil. Interesting. That's high damage, but also damages the character for fourth of the current HP. Okay. Execute. That's a support. Damage from offensive abilities is increased by 45 when the attack, uh, when the target's HP is below half. These are some, ev like these are like Dark Knight abilities, huh? Slow, yeah, it's always nice. Counters any offensive action taken by inflicting slow. So instead of having counterattack, I could slow people who hit me. I might like that, but I'm not sure. Wrathful Beam damages in a line, a line with a range of one. What? Area four, okay. So I target in front of me, and it goes four, okay. That would be good with smart casting, probably. Uh, thanks for following, Mike Shanks. Welcome to the flock, hope you enjoy the stream. You'll notice you require a lot of AP for every one of these abilities. This is a slower to level class, probably because they assume you're gonna keep her as a marked, as her main class the majority of the game. Character grants a slight damage bonus and damage reduction for each fallen ally up to three. That's probably not actually that strong. Holy Bolt, yeah. It's the same as Dark Bolt, but Holy, which I'm guessing is good against evil things. Drain Soul. Steals MP, drain health. Really, the majority of these abilities are like... I figured the March would be kind of like a Paladin. A lot of these abilities are like a Dark Knight, you know? Huh. That's interesting. Okay, well she... The vicarious learning thing that Pierre was telling us about the other day. If you... Every time you win a battle and you had people on your team who were other classes, you gain 20% of the AP on those classes. So we're... We are slowly building a little bit of Scoundrel and Knight. Uh, Taunt or Thorns. Taunt inflicts Berserk. Thorns... Uh, grants thorns after being attacked. That's a re reaction ability, and I like my counterattack reaction ability more. Defensive hit is probably pretty strong. Yeah, we're dealing our attack based on defense. How high is our defense compared to our attack? Equal. That'd be useful later, but not now. I'll take taunt. Scoundrel, dirty hit or steal item. I like dirty hit. Do I want her to be a marked right now? Because I like her outright ability, but these two, neither of these two seem incredible. Executes cool. There we go, bought the game. <laughs> I hope you enjoy it. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna get Execute and maybe Wrathful Beam and then switch for a little while. We'll see. I'll at least to get execute, because that seems like a solid um that seems like a solid support ability. Okay. And do I still want Warcraft as our second or do I want chivalry? I think I want chivalry on her. And she can still use spears. Okay, I'll keep her with the silver spear for now. Alright, Rainer, what have you learned? Scoundrel. All right, you had three levels of mercenary? Yeah. Actually, I wouldn't mind getting him counterattack at some point, but 
Okay, Scoundrel, we can learn. Finally, Sneak Attack. I think this one's gonna be strong. It's 40% weaker than a regular attack, but it does way more damage if you're at their side or their back, which I'd rather be anyway. There we go. I'm really happy with it, those abilities. I think he's finally ready to switch class. So he's got a lot of Scoundrel. Um, so let's look at our other classes that are available that are based in Scoundrel. Scoundrel and three Wizard or Scoundrel and three Mender are both classes. These use Diggers and Spears. These use Mauls and Mazes. I'm guessing this is like a Spell Sword. Perfect Focus, Mana Expert, Initiative, Lucky. See, this, I don't know what these two are going to be, and so I'm really interested. The stat growth on this one is super jack of all trades. Okay, well, you need some Mender to get to Wizard anyway, so we'll make him a Mender now, which is weird to think. Uh, and his secondary is Maria. going to be Trickery, because that's what he's got most of his abilities in. Maria. Thanks for following, uh, Buffaloa? Buffaloa! Oh, that's a good username. Welcome to the flock. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Makes, uh, Fell Seal, Arbiter's Mark, so it makes sense you have all the dark powers. I guess so. Game seems to be, seems to be making out that being marked is an awful fate. Yeah. Kind of seems like it. All right. I do probably want him to sit out for a fight, though. I need to buy another wooden staff for him. All right. What have we learned here? It takes a long time to do the, um, this stuff, the, what do you want to call this? It takes a long time to do the, uh, troop management, but I actually have a lot of fun doing this dirty hit. It's, it's so good being able to blind people. Okay, uh, protect. That seems really good for keeping other people alive and preventing injury is really important. Okay, we can finally learn, uh, mass barrier. Barrier or small area until a barrier. Uh, this is, yeah, uh, something we have to actually cast and across. Barrier will automatically evade the next offensive status effect placed on them. That doesn't seem super powerful. I might want to save it for mass renew. And then just get for get haste. Yeah, I think I'm actually going to save up. And scoundrel, dirty hit. Why not? All right, Plague Doctor. We can get Mass Slow. Beautiful. Scoundrel. Dirty hit. A lot of people are vicariously getting a level of Scoundrel because they've fought so many battles with a Scoundrel on the team. <laughs> Rainer, the Mint Mender. All right. And we're going to move Marinery back to being a Mender. I want to learn more Mender abilities. And Ability Set. Ability Treatment. Yes. So that her... Her minor is, uh, is her Plague Doctor moves. Okay, learn abilities. Ranger. Beautiful. Okay, Balm. Can use it on myself or someone next to me and remove a lot of negative uh, afflictions. Or Scout, which is another ability. Cross Shape on Self. Reveals all traps on a six radius and the, around the character and grants up to crit. Yeah, increasing the ch and overall increase the chance to score a critical hit, which I'm guessing was the upgrade. I'm not sure why I said that twice. Those both seem good. I already have a lot of things that remove status affliction, so I'm going to get Scout. And he can learn another thing. Right, right. I was intentionally not doing that. Yeah. Okay. Mintenery. I like it. All right, let's buy some equipment. We'll do a try and buy. Uh, we need him to have a staff. Just a regular staff will do. I want to switch out for a boar spear on Anodyne, because spears seem really good, and she was using the shitty short sword. Um, I think we do want to move to a white staff on Marinery. Yeah, it makes her immune to being silenced or muted, which would keep her from casting. That alone makes it worth it. I think I'm happy with those minor changes there. There we go. 
Scouts were like this. It increases crit passively and can give a crit boost buff. Okay, that's cool. That's powerful, but potentially. I mean, we combine that with, um, if we combine that with how Rainer, does he have it set right now actually? Yeah, attack expert does more damage. And isn't there an ability in Scoundrel? Um, exploit witness and uh, um, weakness increases crit, a uh, critical hit damage by 50%. I could get that at some point. And uh, the stacking of those two things, having someone you scout next to him would be pretty powerful. Why is the boar spear red? Oh, it was just showing that she didn't own it yet. I was buying it. She has it equipped now if we look here. Oh, by the way, I don't remember who it was in the chat the other stream who said to look up a game called Keeper RL, I think it was called. Uh... I bought it for 15 bucks on Steam. I played about an hour of it earlier today. Super fucking cool, way up my alley. Thank you so much whoever recommended that. That is a cool game. All right, um, I wanna, I think I might just go do like an old patrol or something because I wanna do a battle and uh, I, I wanna do a battle and give Raynor a chance to get healed before we do our next story fight. So what are our levels right now? Five, four, 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 four. Okay. So mostly level four. Uh, let's go to the guild and hire another person so that if someone's injured, there's someone I can use if it's an easier fight. All right, so we're hiring another person. We can spend up to that much for a level five. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna shell the money, get a level five. This person is going to be, first name we see in the chat is, oh, that's Marinery, <laughs> Dejin. Tokugawa. There we go. All right. You've got the hat from Cave Story on. Finally hiring again. Yep, you're in. This one looks cute. I kind of like this design, actually. I'm kind of digging it. Uh, the portrait in the bottom left, not so good. I might, I might change the color scheme a little. I don't, I'm not really digging the hat. Keep this. Hey, if you like this design, we can keep this one. Do you want any class outfits? Like, uh, you match whatever your class is? What do I want to do with this character, actually? I can pick your starting class. Um, well, if we one of the classes we're going for that seems like a rarer one is um, Scoundrel and Wizard. Why don't we try and make this one, we, we try and unlock the Scoundrel um, Mender one with this character. We see what that is, see if we like them. Keep the outfit, change the portrait, can do. I like that idea. So I think I'm going to have her start as a Scoundrel so that by having that, she can bypass having to be a mercenary for a fight just to get a little closer to this because Mender is a base thing. We can just change to a Mender after we have the three Scoundrel perks. All right, I like that idea. Okay. These are all like enemy portraits because they have no eyes. Okay, what here looks reasonably accurate? That one is not awful. That one has the hat, but the hair is way off. What looks reasonably similar? I don't mind that one, actually. That's kind of cool looking. I don't want it to have to match like fucking perfectly where I have to redesign the character for it. Okay, so for, of the options it's giving me for this character, <laughs> oh my god, that's ill-fitting. Uh, I like that one. What a happy looking person. We're gonna go with that. All right, some serious money I had to drop there, but we actually have quite a bit saved up, so I'm fine with it. Okay, try and buy. Here we go. Dejin Tokugawa. You started with, it auto-equipped you with a heavy crossbow and a traveler's garb. I'm actually cool with you having the heavy crossbow so you can fight at a range a little bit. I want more people who are capable of ranged combat. Wish I could sub, but can't use any of my money. Sorry, don't worry about it. You never need to apologize for not subscribing. My show's free. Uh, let's throw some leather armor on you, maybe. You're not gonna be able to wear it once you're a mender, but we can always just, you know, pass it down to someone else. Um, you probably don't really need any other equipment. Yeah, you're probably good with that, actually. And hey, Rainer, we're gonna finally change out your, your traveler's robe for, yeah, a leather armor. You need a little more defense. You're often in the front line. 
Wizard's Glove. Uh, um... I think I'm going to keep him with that. And do we want to change it the, flir the fur cap? No, fur cap gives that water resistance. I kind of like that. Probably because it keeps you warm. Confirm purchase. There we go. <laughs> You'll probably be worth it. Yeah, probably. Uh, is the arena open yet? No. Okay. I want to go back to this place. And the patrol's level 4 to 8. It could end up being way too strong for us, I guess. Can we patrol in the capital? No. I just want to patrol somewhere that there's there's uh, loot to get. Because, like, in Timber Road, there's treasure there, but we can't reach it until we have someone who can jump higher or, like, teleport or something. We already have the treasure there. And this is an achievement for getting all the treasure, so I want it. Any more uh, Terraria streams planned any time this year? This year, definitely. You'd love a series with Brandon and the expert mode? Yeah, we did the expert mode. We did a whole playthrough of that. Um, I want to get more Brandon. It's just, you know, he's so busy with the military. He actually just graduated his... Um, he got he passed his, like, degree in electronics. So he can start working on... Uh, he can start working on repairing planes because he's part of our Air Force soon. And he should be moving soon to a military base that's closer to home so that he can drive home on the weekends and he'll have a little bit of time to record again. But we don't know exactly when that's going to be. It's still probably at least a year off before he's living in his own house, not on a military base. Um, as for more Terraria streams, I want to do some multiplayer Terraria streams soon where it's just we let all of you guys in and just goof off and do ridiculous shit. And congratulations to Brandon. You have a cousin in the military. That's awesome. I don't know if it's the same military, just because I don't know if you're Canadian, but, you know, that's awesome. Anyway, 